Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Chronicles of Riddick, Escape from Butcher Bay, with your host, the Popcorn Gamer. And hey, it's Tiddly Week, guys. What did you do last part? Uh, I, I shipped, <laughs> I, I kind of killed someone. Like, this is not what I remember the second part ending here. Um, what do you call it? If you get too close to a guard, they will punch you. <laughs> if you get too close to them for too long, uh, they will start shooting you. Oh, lovely. I know you can kill this guard and kind of get away with it. I did it in the HD port, but I don't think I'd do it here. Because there's only one guard that picks up Rust's body in the HD port. Hmm. If you plan on 100%ing this game, this guy here, you're going to want to kill him. <laughs> because in order to finish one of the quests, you have to kill all of the blue skins. I don't show how to get to all the blue skins, but I do make sure to kill every single one I come across. Yeah. Right, so don't, don't smoke while being pregnant. Okay. Once again... Do not smoke, it's bad for you. Do not endorse that. Your breath will smell terrible. <laughs> oh yeah, and this guy gives me an uppercut. Because I, I shiv him. He gives you a what? An uppercut. What's this? He just stands there, pretends he's cool. Then I do the unlisted, try doing the unlisted time on him. And uh, he's and in the he trash can. Yeah, he disappears into a trash can. Well, at least I don't have to clean up after him. <laughs> So, uh, I think I show this away. off here. I think I pull out the shiv, and I'm going to kill this guard, right? Uh, but with different weapons, you get uh, different kind of kills. Uh, the knuckle duster is the only exception, but the shiv and the club get different kinds of animations for the kill. This is the Ooh. fast kill for it. In, a, in another version, he stabs the guy's neck. Oh, that's that's wonderful. I'm trying to take the body off. <laughs> Instead, I I give you it. You just kind of teabag yourself. I teabag myself. <laughs> I'm like yum. And uh, if you walk, if the cameras catch you with a weapon out, it's going to tell you right now. You will get shot at, indiscriminately. You can put if you put the uh, weapon away fast enough, the cameras will ignore you. But. If you don't do it fast enough, the cameras will start shooting at you, and that area will not be safe ever again. <laughs> and uh, Red does not have his leg. He lost his leg in the battle yeah, between me a... and Rust. <laughs> there was an explosion. But that that's like, he just kind of fell down some snows no and had to amputate. I mean, it, it wasn't no all that exciting relief. for him. He's also very good at balancing on that one leg. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We'll find another to take his place. Still, we this is the glitchiest the run I've ever had <laughs> in this game. You will see that... Uh, at least Here's in the very beginning, there's a lot of glitches. Uh, a lot of people sitting sideways on chairs. Um, just funny stuff like that. <laughs> so I'm checking how much cash I have. I have 80 bucks. And, money uh, is rainbow. Yeah, money <laughs> is rainbow. And that's plenty hey, enough to buy the smokes you, from you Thunder. A pack of smokes? <laughs> Hand them over. You can only <laughs> get these smokes if you buy them. Is Booger the only person you can buy him from? Yeah, this uh, makes you less immortal. <laughs> Definitely tell us something about six. But um, a lot of shops carry cigarettes, right? Yeah. And um, they carry a lot. A lot of shops carry a lot of cigarettes. In this case, Booger only had one pack. But there's a shop later on that uh, yeah, you in the habit. fourth part. That's think? integrity. That. So I'll keep my word. Carries like ten what packs of cigarettes, but they go up five bucks for each pack. Looks like a way pack out. Be like way out? or something. Yeah. Sure. Nice. And you have it's Raise some help. it's pretty and ridiculous. You, you have to save all your cash and if kill just about everyone for their cash if you want to get that final cigarette pack. From down there. I don't show it off. I show it's off me buying done. one of them. I like it. But um Well, then Pigsville's your place. For the most part staff quarters and um you can get to the spaceport hangers from there. I just go along the but main game. You would need a rifle. This isn't a one hundred percent rod. I'm I'm warning you again. If you <laughs> yeah. commentate if you uh one hundred percent run or you say I'm bad or something. I'll, I'll be okay with if you say I'm bad. But 
We like the the no, comments telling us how we're doing. Crawl. Yeah, we also we like comments There's saying how we're doing. From the but infirmary that I think connects to the main uh, if you're just oh. being rude, and if you want I'm going to take that comment gates, off. Okay, we'll happen. probably just block you. We'll, we'll block do. you. He owes me one it's not that. fair for us. It's not fair for the other viewers who will enjoy us. No dilly daddling on our videos. Yes. Back to red. <laughs> <laughs> So, Haley just told us about how uh, there's this assault rifle mainframe where we can get our DNA into the mainframe and pick up assault rifles and use them. The thing is, we gotta sneak in there through the infirmary. Good news is, Haley's got a bet, had a bet on you when you killed Rust. So, you can get in through the, uh, through one of his friends. That's uh, a former guard. So, you know, I'm, I'm contemplating, I'm walking away, but I remember, I need to kill everyone I can. <laughs> Wanna live? Get a shit. Too late. Well, I'm on. He's gonna like, what? <laughs> yeah, you can kill this guy before he gets up if you're quick enough. Like, they're, oh, someone's stabbing me, let's get up as slowly as possible. I'm gracious. I approve. <laughs> <laughs> I don't kill Garish. This is the only like one of the few people I don't kill. <laughs> oh wait. Oh, I, that's my bad. I accidentally entered my uh, cell. I <laughs> three guess three times. Three times. Three times. My first guess was right. But that, you don't have to go in there for a third time. You only have to go in there twice. You want to talk to this, this guy. For you need to make sure to talk to this guy so you can get a, a piece of paper from you. him. You need to also have killed Molina. So that there's two people who have a problem with Molina. It's a secret code to something in the infirmary, which gives you uh, an improved shiv. Uh, but the moment you go into that door, everyone starts shooting at you, so you're going to be <laughs> careful. Says you but you need to kill everyone in that room that anyway, so... You, it's all good. It's all you good. It pays off. It does pay off. Him. You screwed yourself by betting against me. Now, the infirmary. Man, you look like how I feel, like shit. Okay, go on through. <laughs> Hurry up. Some intimidation right there. Yeah, that's, that was Haley's friend that he, uh, that Haley won against. Okay, now you see these rooms that, uh, I didn't cut the loading out here. <laughs> My bad, guys. These rooms are empty. These are always the rooms where there's loading. And loading's pretty quick. It's just quick as that. Once it's reached the bottom, you're done. It, that it, guy with the assault rifle, the, the moment you can, button. sneak into the room and snap his neck. Just use a quick attack, because the other guy's going to see you. Because um, you need to kill that guy for a specific security code. What, that dude? This dude, this guy who was on the door. You need to kill him for a security code. This keypad. And this guy only gets in the way if you, if you try to... But here's me. I'm going to fail here. <laughs> I'm going to walk right into the room where they shoot you if you walk into it. They they mercy kill one of the guards. That one of the kids on the... They just kill him for no reason. No <laughs> reason. Everyone in the infirmary is just guilty. They're just guilty. Yes. Oh. But here's a pack of six, uh, not endorsed by real doctors. <laughs> and uh, a scalpel, which is an improved ship. It's, uh, it does it does do a fair bit of damage, but you're not going to really be using it, unfortunately. Like, because the moment you go into this room is one of the many stealth segments of this game. Ooh. What? Um, also, yeah, you just noticed that uh, that card didn't really care the fact that his friend was in front of him. <laughs> Just like, no, I'm if, if you're good, you can line the enemies up so that they kill each other for you. So if I wanted to, this guy with who's punching me right now and kicking the ass out of me. <laughs> um. Yeah, I just lost three of my health segments. Wah, 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 wah. Um. You can have him get shot by the guard. Oh yeah, and bedpost in the eye. <laughs> I'm trying to grab the assault rifle, showing it does hurt you. It does, in fact, hurt you, so don't even bother. Creepy-ass voice. 
But there are different voices for it. That's something I like. This door's closed. Be careful the moment you open this door. Ah, I forgot. And you put in the security code. Well then, my ADD goes somewhere else. Looks at the person. Um, I thought they shot him. Oh, they no, shot the other guy. Up. Oh. Did you see that? <laughs> Did you see that neck fail? Uh huh. Well then, okay. Now you gotta be careful about this door because the moment that you open it, there's a guy on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> he uses very colorful language. So this is one of the guys that it does start becoming harder to use the infinite combo on. It's still possible, but um, you just gotta be careful of their uppercuts. Because the uppercuts will always stag you from my uh, experience. <laughs> yeah, this is just me waiting. <laughs> and then I got a counter on him, so I snapped him in the neck. Now, first time players who don't have the instruction manual, um, they're just gonna run up that stairway and act like, uh, run up that ladder and act like it's nothing. But this is very important. This is called a health station. You sit in that chair and, um, you get an extra health segment. It's kind of cool. But it, it's so, it's not even worth it. I mean, just watch. It doesn't look worth it. No. <laughs> But in game, it actually. Is yeah, in game, it has no it, holes in his shirt for that. I just realized <laughs> that. But now you have five health segments. I find a total of three of them in the HD port. I found uh, four of them. So I think I missed one in this run. Hmm. You didn't do all the hidden stuff, though, did you? Uh, I didn't get all the hidden stuff. I said this is not a 100% run. To get all the cigarettes, you have to do all the quests. And this is me, oh wait, this is me discovering that I can in fact lean side to side. Because in this segment, you want to know whether you can lean or not. So if you lean, get behind this box and lean, the guard will walk right by you. <laughs> You're like, derp, 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 derp. Like you just sees a head peeking out, oh, there's nothing there. So Neil, from your experience of the game, how many times have you really felt like the stealth was that good. I, it depends on your play style, kind of. Like, there are a few people that will just tank it and a few that will stealth it all the way through. I understand. I, I see where you're coming from. I played this game when I was like 13, so I just tanked it all the way. I didn't use stealth at all. Uh, I do try my very... Like I said in the first part, I'm trying my very best to be stealthy. But... It's really difficult later on down the line, and the stealth mechanics uh, are very bad. They aren't good in large open areas. In smaller areas where the solution is obvious and you can get away easily. Like right here. Like right here. Yeah. These are the good stealth segments where this game, it shines, it shows how it, it should have many sequels. This guy always catches you, by the way. Uh, it should have many sequels, but it only has the one sequel in, the, in an HD port. Uh, now you might be asking, why did that guy catch me? That's because they can catch you out of the freaking corners of their eyes. <laughs> they will never stare at you, but if they can catch you out of the corner of their eyes, they will always catch you. Wolf packs. Oh yeah, and there is a... Uh, uh, a riot going on right now. You can just quick kill this guy. You can, most of the time you can quick kill everyone, but I don't want to show off the slow kill for the knife. And, uh, most of the time you don't even have to bother hiding the body. <laughs> I'm like, oh my gosh, I need to hide this body. I need to make sure that I didn't miss anything and hide this body. <laughs> and I'm like, wait, I don't need to hide this body, I'm Riddick. <laughs> <laughs> Something I like about this game, unlike a lot of other movie licensed titles, uh, they actually make you feel like you are the character. Yeah, instead of just kind of watching it. And um, we're going to watch the ballerina of the 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 uh, guard kicking, Whoa. synchronized card kicking. Oh. It's always the first one, the second, and the third. Must have been rehearsing. 
Na 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 Glue do 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 Okay, we're done with that. <laughs> Now the guard. This is the guard from earlier. Stab. <laughs> Walkie walk walk. Um, something I didn't explain earlier. Uh, if you are in the shadows, you're in your crouch, your screen will turn blue. That shows that you are in the shadows. And it can get really annoying when you're on the edge of a shadow. <laughs> the screen will constantly turn blue. <laughs> I don't think you're gonna be able to fit. <laughs> yeah. This is this is a really weird thing. I think you're supposed to drop assassinate this dude, but this this that's not that's not very safe. <laughs> it will get you killed a lot. So what I do. I walk on that, you crouch, I think, yeah, and Riddick does like floating, so, um, <laughs> he's floating right now. And then he falls. And then you will not sustain any damage. Is that a gun? Do you get to get that gun? Shink. So a screwdriver it's another shiv type weapon. You can only carry one, so don't try to carry one. Hey, it's that DNA scanner from earlier. <laughs> and then you gotta run for that assault rifle. Run for it as quickly as you can. No, things get like I said earlier, this game is pretty hardcore, so all your ammo information is on the gun itself. Which can screw you over in the long run, so you kinda gotta get this. They can screw you on the darker part. Yeah. But the good thing is, the clip counter does tell you how many clips you have. Just make sure not to reload unless you really need to. Like That's the man. That's the flashlight. Only ever useful in this part of the game. Because in the next part, we will be picking up the signature, uh... Hey, gun. Hey, it's just gun. <laughs> <laughs> it's a gun. Grenade! I'd catch a grenade for you. Oh, yeah. This is Popcorn Has Talent. Welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, skulls. That's very welcome. And shotgun. shotgun. So yeah, there's only three basic guns. Assault rifle, shotgun, pistol. Or gun, my bad. <laughs> yeah, gun. gun. <laughs> How dare you. Um, the assault rifle's obviously the best of the three. And the shotgun's completely worthless. It's only worth uh, in a couple segments where you have to use it. The assassination is old school for it. Uh, like yeah. where you point it at him and you shoot him with it. Yeah. But, um... I don't think I show that off. No, it's the one, yeah, you did in the first thing where you like try to disarm him, you push it towards the head. Oh, you mean the disarm? Yeah. Yeah, that one is pretty cool. But that's pretty much all the guns. You, you, you show them off. Uh, I do try to show off all the disarms. I think I do manage to show it all, all them off, but I think I missed the club. If Not you guys know of any that we missed, just write it in the comments. And, and I will put up an extra video for later. Uh, if Neil wants to, if anyone wants to, the HP port does have one multiplayer. That'd be fun. And, uh, if we can get a couple friends together, uh, we would be willing to, uh, do the multiplayer at the HD port, which are, is pretty interesting. Uh, there's a prison riot mode where there's, like, three teams. To, at any given moment, two teams are made up of the prisoners of Butcher Bay. And uh, the one team is the guards, and they switch off or something like that. Nice. And uh, there's a standard fair, which is team deathmatch. Security breach in mainframe uh, area. We call it deathmatch. And there's one particular mode I like. I got to play it twice. Uh, it was oh the three matches I played. With. I got to play it twice. 
Uh, it was, uh... I can't get what the mode is called, but you get to play as Riddick. Oh, and, so you mean like this? <laughs> no, you get to play as Riddick. All you were armed with were Ulaks, the uh, signature weapon of Riddick, which you don't get to see in this game, which sucks. But you, you're armed with the Ulaks, and... Uh, you're armed with the dark vision. And there's this giant pit where you're the only one in it. And the guards, the 16 or 15 guards, had to jump down that pit and find you and kill you. It's kind of like tag. Whoever kills who's it, whoever's uh, Riddick, gets to uh, become Riddick in the next round. It's, it's pretty neat. I liked it. Of course, the uh, the three or four kids I was playing against got uh, <laughs> severely beaten because they sucked. Might make you strange. Oh, I must have been smoking those. Once again, we do not endorse smoking. <laughs> Don't do it. They're very bad. I know one person's gonna comment and be like, "Oh, but smoking's okay. It's totally justified." Blah 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 blah. It'll happen. <laughs> It'll happen. Uh, overkill. I wanted to show off that uh, that body suit attain damage as you shoot. So you shot him in the balls. Why would you do such a thing? Butters, you never shoot in the ball. South Park reference, any? South Park? Question mark? <laughs> South Park. This is too much. Can we even catch a stupid con? Uh huh. We'll let him run. This is where I originally thought, hey, that's Marcus from Gears of War. Oh god. Take cover. I do have to say that this is the most one of the more boring parts of the game, because it's just the standard point and shoot at this point, guys. But um This game this game doesn't manage to excel in any one particular area. I had to say. I like it, but I don't like it that much. It doesn't I, have a lot of replaying value. It is one of the greatest, let me get this straight, it is still one of the greatest games I've ever played. Because it actually is one of the few licensed title games to make me feel like the character. In this case, Riddick. But, think, if you're going to think about this, think of it as a crappy Dishonored. Where there's, you can have a choice between tanking it, like... Neil said, yeah. or you can choose to uh, sneaky, stealth sneaky. it. But a lot of times, like in this particular section, they force you to be sneaky. Oh, you just wasted a clip. I know. I did. <laughs> but they give you plenty of ammo. It's only on the hard difficulty you have to really worry about that. I'm trying to see if there's a way around uh, not getting ambushed. I want to kill these guys as quickly as possible. Not doing a very good job at it, but <laughs> uh, eventually, uh, on the elevator, I believe it's either timed or it's after you kill these guys. I believe it's timed. Uh, on the elevator, there's a robot that comes down. Oh, lovely. And it's, pi it's one of the few robots you get to pilot. I, I think you only get to pilot this particular robot in uh, the HD port, because I couldn't find it in this port. Hmm. Like, what is it? Like a mech? It's, it's a mech. It's a pretty cool mech. Use a shotgun on this guy. It's suggested because you kind of have to get close to even shoot at him. And so you don't want to miss any shots. Just a shotgun is the way to go on this dude. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. This guy's pretty stupid, too. <laughs> Just strategy will work. I'm like, I'm trapped, I don't know what to do. <laughs> One, ready, climb, damn you! You can only shoot him in the back, so don't try shooting him from the front. But otherwise, pretty easy mini boss. You do get cigarettes. They contain a small amount, amount of poison. <laughs> the beetle blend. Now you're like, well, now what do I do? 
Um, I'm looking for cigarettes, just in case I can show off any, uh, extra. I got extra gun ammo. <laughs> just, just gone. Oh yeah, I lost the health segment because I got crushed by the, the elevator. That's something that always happened to me whenever I played this game. <laughs> I always... Get crushed. I always get crushed by the elevator. <laughs> And you can't stop it because you're you're in an animation. Okay, so now we're going back to the uh the area where we're at earlier, and there's a riot going on. We're going to the earlier than the earlier. <laughs> Damn it! I just realized that I realized I said that. You're we're like, going what? to the part where we are at earlier. Um, there's a riot going on, like I said earlier, and that guy's dead because he got shot in the nuts. <laughs> God damn it, butters! Sneaky, sneaky. Ah, oh, Javier, why'd you do that? I just want to get a sneak on him so I could uh, get easy shot. Looking at that turret, that's actually a megaphone. <laughs> like, I'm, oops. I'm gonna reload, and uh, you see off in the very, very distance, there's this a very small turret. Don't want to shoot those things. Oh, that was one. Because later on, the turrets are just a nuisance. They will take half your health in six shots, and that's when you <laughs> have seven health bars. I have no clue. <laughs> it's a nobody, I guess. <laughs> like oats? Is it shooting at you? It is shooting at me. <laughs> I think the bullets were glitched. What cell block is this? This is cell block A. So it's like a no, that was, that was a uh, woman in Garish's cell. cell. <laughs> almost out here! Almost out here! <laughs> if you um do manage to get hurt really quickly, your your uh, cells do start going 3D. Those are Neomed cartridges. Didn't explain them earlier. If a uh, Neomed health station. Add up heals. You can put that in there and get a quick, uh, get more heals out of it. <laughs> All the heals. Grenade! Ricochet. No, <laughs> So you want to pick up that radio transmitter that I almost walked away from. It's floating in the air right now. Open and up. Riddick's going to be like, yeah, open the door. <laughs> yeah, open the door. I'm going to go back up for some heels. And you don't need to, uh, to, uh, to heal again because you just need enough health to Get to the next gunfight. Which, unless you suck at gunfights, you might want to go back in. <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, it's a load of that guy. <laughs> I just got health just in case something happened. Thor! Someone we didn't meet earlier. <laughs> he's asking you to put him out of your mystery, but he's actually invulnerable. He doesn't exist in the game now. Until uh, after he dies. There you oh, go. <laughs> Just in case. You're using your gun, I see. I'm using gun. <laughs> I wait, I'm God wasting all my butter. Stop shooting him in the balls. <laughs> I'm using all my gun ammo.
This is this is the best thing to do. <laughs> It ain't the fall that gets you. <laughs> Ooh. Snap, crackle, pop. It's a sudden stop at the bottom. I hate this part so much. I I don't find it that difficult. It's really easy. All the like monster things, man. This part's. No, oh, but that's that, my friends. That's not till next next episode. Oh, we're gonna leave a cliffhanger. We are. We all. I always set it up so we can leave it cliffhangers. <laughs> so till next time, ladies and gentlemen. This has been your hosts, the Popcorn Gamer. And Tiddly Week. Goodbye and make sure to like, subscribe, and leave a rate. Exactly. So goodbye. I hope you enjoyed the episode. And till next time. Bye.